The first step, once you have a cloud site, will be to set up your project. Whether you're a software development team, marketing team, legal team, or a project manager, setting up your next project in JIRA is easy. So typically a project can be defined as a collection of tasks that need to be completed to achieve a certain outcome. And in JIRA, a project can be thought of as almost like a container used to organize and track those tasks across the entire team. And the great thing about a JIRA project is that it's highly configurable and can be easily customized to fit any organizational structure, any workflow, or level of maturity. This makes JIRA the only tool to fit any team's unique way of working. Let's go ahead and get started by creating a project. In the top navigation, go ahead and select the projects dropdown. You'll be able to save any projects that you've been working on or see any recent projects. But to get started with the new one, go ahead and select Create Project. You'll notice here that you can choose from several already made templates to get your project started quickly. Just take a look at the different types of teams that can use JIRA and have templates ready to go, such as legal, HR, sales, finance, and more. We'll go ahead and start with the project from the software development folder, and you can click on the project template and read a description of what the project entails and how you can use it. Once you've selected your project template, you'll then be prompted to choose between two project types, team managed projects or company managed projects. I do want to take some time and pause a little here and go over the difference between these two project types. Team managed projects are for teams that want simplified configuration and want more control over their own working processes and practices. Team managed projects are managed by project administrators, meaning that changes can be implemented without requiring the help of a JIRA admin. These project types are typically better for small teams looking to get started quickly. On the other hand, company managed projects are managed by JIRA admins who encourage and promote organizational best practices and processes through a shared configuration. This project type is better for larger teams that want standardization across multiple projects and multiple teams. We'll go ahead and start with the team managed project for the sake of this demo. From here, you will then get to name your project and select an access level, which will allow you to restrict who can view your project. So whether it is by invite only, or whether you want your projects open to other teams to view, or you want it open for all teams to be able to view and create issues, you can select your access type. For this project, we'll go ahead and select private and hit next. All right, on this next screen, it'll allow you to connect JIRA to any other Atlassian product. We'll show an example of JIRA and Confluence later, but for now, let's just go ahead and click continue. And there you have it, your first project. 